start taking prenatal vitamins. Yeah, very important, but unfortunately that might not be enough actually to get your baby critical nutrients in the earliest stages of life. And a new study shows that getting a specific vitamin early on can greatly reduce your odds of autism. Yeah, here's CBS 5's morning anchor Nicole Kreitz. Former U of A ASU basketball stars April and Lester Neal were over the moon when they found out they were pregnant. She read all the books and started taking prenatal vitamins. I was a high-risk pregnancy because I was 35. Her baby boy came early. Bryce was born at seven months and spent a long time in the NICU learning to eat, digest, and grow until he was strong enough to go home. So he was there three months, one week, and four days. The majority of the organs developing in the fetus happen even before women are pregnant, I mean, realize they're pregnant or very early on. Dr. Maria Manrique says if you wait till you know you're pregnant to make sure you're healthy, it can be too late. I think preconception care is huge. So not just prenatal, preconception nutrition, and the most important in those first days and months of life is folic acid. The heart is forming, the brain is forming, that neural tube closing. Especially being African American, um, we, we're more susceptible. Other minorities like Hispanics and Native Americans are also 70% less likely to have brain defects or spina bifida if mom takes folic acid early. Well, in hindsight, if I had known that, things might have turned out a little bit different. Bryce is five now, healthy and happy. And a new study just published in the Journal of American Medical Association gives even more reason to take folic acid early. Scientists in Norway followed 85,000 newborns, six years, and found a 40% lower rate of autism in mothers who started taking folic acid four weeks before conception and eight weeks after. It certainly isn't going to hurt, and it may possibly be um, a, a way to decrease the, the rate of autism. You really, you know, the, the rumor, don't talk about your pregnancy until you're three months and we know it's viable, it can make a difference. You know, and it can also make a difference in if your, you know, child has any birth defects or anything. You can get folic acid from a lot of different foods, cereals, carrots, asparagus, broccoli. But this is important. If you cook these veggies even longer than five minutes, if they're rubbery at all, you've lost all their nutritional value. Nicole Kreitz, CBS 5 News. Thanks, Nicole. March of Dimes has made a huge difference in educating moms to raise healthy babies. Their annual March for Babies is tomorrow at Wesley Bolin Plaza downtown. And we put a link with all of the information you need.